In this video, we will discuss about method of risk identification. We will discuss what are the methods of risk identification, what are the steps of risk identification, and what is the Delphi method. One of the exam question. What is the prime objective of risk identification? Primary objective of risk identification process is to recognize the current threats, vulnerabilities, assets and controls of the organization. What are the sources of risk identification? A risk practitioner can identify the risk through various available sources such as by reviewing past audit reports, incident reports, public media articles, press releases, through some systematic approach like VA, PT, BCP and DLP documents. They can also interact with senior management and process owner to understand the current threats and vulnerabilities and by conducting various scenario analysis. Please note, these are the illustrative list and there can be many more ways to identify the risk. Risk Identification and Risk Register All the identified risks should be captured in a centralized risk register along with relevant details like description, category, probability, impact and other relevant details. One of the exam question, maintenance of risk register process starts with, yes, our answer should be risk identification process. Risk identification process is the initial step of risk management process and risk register should be maintained from the initial step itself. What are the steps of risk identification? In first step, information is gathered and critical assets of the organization is identified. For example, data may be critical assets for your organization. Next step is to identify the threat. Hacker can be threat for your data. Third step is to identify the existing control. You may have built in logical controls. Fourth step is to identify the open vulnerabilities. Your NTM malware software may not be working, may not be available. Fifth step is to identify the impact or consequences of this threat. Impact can be penalty, loss of reputation. Step 1, gather the information and identify the asset. Step 2, identify the threat. Step 3, identify existing controls. Step 4, identify the open vulnerabilities. Step 5. Identify the consequences. Delphi method of risk identification. In simple form, 
this is the method to collect certain information in first step questionnaires are designed what kind of information is to be collected in second step answers are collected in step, third step answers are analyzed and then appropriate action is taken But what make this method different is in this method information gathering can be done either openly or anonymously or privately between interviewer and interview in such case organization may get some critical information which would have not been got during open interview Let us discuss some key aspects from exam perspective. In which technique employees are allowed to identify risk anonymously? Delphi technique. Preparation of a risk register starts with which of risk management step? Risk register should be maintained from initial steps only. The moment you identify the risk, you should register it. You should document it. That is risk identification. Stage. What is the primary objective of risk identification? To detect threats and vulnerabilities. What is the first step in risk identification? Information gathering. These are the steps for risk identification. Information gathering to identify the assets, identify threats, Identify existing controls, identify vulnerabilities, and finally identify the consequences. Let us discuss some practice questions. Delphi technique. Maintenance of risk register starts from which of the following risk management phase? Risk identification.
which of the following is the first step in risk identification and assessment process. Initial step is to capture information on current and future state of business environment. On the basis of that, other steps can be considered. Primary purpose of a risk identification is to detect threats and vulnerabilities. Primary purpose for maintenance of risk register is to risk register is maintained to document all the identified risks. It is practically not feasible to have a zero risk environment. Mere maintenance of risk register does not ensure compliance with the regulation. Mere maintenance of risk register does not identify the critical processes of the organization. Thanks for watching.